this is just a quick demonstration of how a second order magnetic gear works. I have a set of 12 magnets arranged in pairs of north-south poles stuck to a steel disc. These are just stainless steel spacers. And then on my pinion I've got four magnets also arranged with north-south, north-south. And then I've got a simulated bulkhead with steel inserts. The ratio of the number of steel inserts relative to the magnets is something that you can calculate. Uh, just go to Wikipedia and have a look under second order magnetic gears and it will tell you exactly how many steel bits you need depending on the amount of pole pairs on your gears. 12 magnets on one, 4 on the other, that will give me exactly the same ratio as a 12 tooth versus a 4 tooth uh, normal gear when they mesh, a ratio of 3 to 1. One advantage of this arrangement is that it allows us to mount all the gears on a single axis and that's the result.